telephone conversation between President Johnson and Congressman Les Ahrens on November 29, 1963 at 6.15 p.m. Please do, and I'm just, uh, uh, I'm just uh, waited. Most of these boys are going to be leaving here and not later than 6.30, and I've, I've tried to get in over an hour. Yeah. You, you want to put, is this uh, you want to make this release tonight? Yeah, oh yeah, I'm going to make an announcement tonight. It's just a question. I'd, I'd just like to be able to say that I had consulted with the leadership. Uh, that's, that's, that it's, a, it's a presidential commission, you see, and I don't, uh, I just want to, uh, I want to work with my friends. That's right, and I, yeah. that's why I called you back, Mr. President. What I want to do is I want to try to get someone that's pretty familiar with the, the defense picture and the foreign relations picture, and uh, also the CIA picture, you see uh, the Hoover picture. We got, to, and that's why I'm trying to get man and handle the kind of high up on military over in the House, and, but uh, uh, Russell on armed services in the Senate. Well, I tell you the reason I Cooper is a former ambassador to India, you see, and Mc, McCloy is a former ambassador. Dulles is former CIA, and uh, I, I don't know. I have no no uh, particular uh, reason for interest in uh, the Republicans, but the hell of it is you can't clear these things. You can't even talk to them. You can't get them. Mike Mansfield's in Florida, Dirksen's in Illinois. And well, let me see if I can't get it, but in the meantime, I, 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 I didn't want to be put in a position where I put an okay on something and then find out that Charlie was jumping or something. And well, I have no, like no, uh, well, what I was just going to, uh, what I was going to do, I was going to try to get him for another 15 minutes and then have to decide what to do about it because yeah. you... Likewise, I'll, I'll work on it too. Did, I'll try to call you back with him. Fine. Just tell him what, what we like to do is have men with the, the military background, the CIA background, the appropriation background. See, we're doing a good deal in this field, Les, that uh, I think you are on the committee, aren't you? You're on the, you're on, you're on the sub, subcommittee there. And uh, so uh, we're trying to spread it out, and we're getting the chairman of armed services, one group, you see, and, and we're trying to go to appropriations with the other that handles appropriations, and we're trying to go to somebody that has a good deal of uh, foreign service, like John Cooper, ambassador. And Dulles, you see, the CIA, and Hale's been talking about this thing, and he talked a little too much today. <laughs> you, know, you know, members of Congress. <laughs> well, that's the trouble. They all talk, you know, and you that's tell them. Now, he called down here and said this fellow was talking. I said, well, I'm trying to work out things like that. Yeah, that's right. Well, you're 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 doing the right thing on this. But uh, if I talk to them, they uh, they talk to the press. So you you try to get back to the 15. Just quick as I can. Bye. Bye.